Hey everyone, it is Hapahai here with another video on Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle. In this video, we're going to be discussing the category GT Boss. And is there going to be a Dokkan Festival exclusive or a LR incoming pretty soon? Well, we'll discuss. So with that, if you're new to my channel, like, subscribe, comment below, do all that good stuff. Yeah, the reason why I'm making this video here is due to the fact we are getting a 130% LR free to play for this category. And I'm thinking, well, are they going to expand this? Because, let's take a look at one, let's take a look at this new unit, the Shadow Dragon's Army, which the art is incredible, so whoever designed it, cheers to them. Um, it's a free-to-play from Battlefield Gems, don't know if it's going to be coming to the global version of the game, it seems like it might be just JP, but we'll see. Uh, but either way, you can look at the GT boss category, it is very, very minimal, right? You have... Uh, the two LRs, this this new LR here, and then Super Baby. And then these TURs, there's not many, right, as you can see here. And then there's a few other SSRs as well. And that's it. So if they're going to keep this free to play more or less, then I can see why they're, they're going to do this 130%. But are they going to expand this category? Because, you know, GT Heroes is actually really, really good. Uh, a lot of units can run on GT Heroes, but on GT Bosses, boy, uh, not much here unless they're going to really, really, um, you know, have a few extra units because, you know, we only have just a few here. Uh, <laughs> I'm just kind of looking at, yeah, it's all pretty similar. There's only one super type you can run as well, which doesn't make any sense because GT Boss, you're looking at more of the, um, the enemies here. But let's take a look at a closer look at this unit right here. Because being a 130% lead, leader, as you can see, is a leader skill here. And the rest of the um, the unit of itself, it's fairly good. It's also a support unit for GT bosses. So if you're not going to make this a viable team, then why even create a support uh, support unit? So you know, this having a super attack uh, causes colossal damage and lowers attack and defense. Really good. The ultra super attack causes mega colossal damage, lowers attack and defense with a medium chance of stunning the enemy. Passive skill is um, attack and defense 70% plus an additional 70% to attack and, and defense when performing a super attack. Um, so it busts up really nicely um, after a super attack. Key plus 4 when the, uh, when the uh, target enemy's attack is down or defense status down. And then you have the GT bosses category key plus 3 attack and defense 30%. Active skills plus 7 and, and uh, it's a debuff all enemies attack and defense minus 30% for one turn and can be activated 7 turns that's quite a quite a while but once again it's a free to play unit I understand why they're doing it this way link skills brutal beat down nightmare fear and faith GT shadow dragons big bad bosses their great power once again I hate this but I guess really they're very very limited it's only 3 categories so not much you can use shadow dragon saga which needs a buff um, join forces and GT possible it would have been nice to see like GT bosses category allies, um, you know, plus three to key attack and defense 30%, and then Shadow Dragon Saga, maybe like you know, attack and defense 20% or something like that, just something extra so you can run this on a Shadow Dragon Saga team, right? You're not going to run this on a you know, joint forces team, probably not, but only on GT bosses. That's kind of why, why I'm thinking about this is if it's only just GT bosses that this should be really optimal on, um, are they going to make this? category a lot better so what are your choices let's talk about the choices and the options that you can choose from when it comes to this category here and you can pretty much see it on the screen i'm not going to talk about kind of the lower tier you know middle real dough real dough it's kind of lower tier you know frieza and cell there really weren't bosses right they were you know dead at the time it really boils down and then some of the shadow dragons here you know not so much it really boils down to three characters and that's pretty much about it so once again, in my mind, I'm going, this is a very limited, limited uh, category. Why even make it a category, right? So the first option, right? Let's talk the three options. The first option is uh, is this one right here, the Super 17, right? Super 17, uh, and I think really what's going to be coming is the, the LR. That's going to be coming on the 13th or something of that nature, part two. I think part two, we might get this LR, 150% because that's kind of where we're doing dual category 150% now I'm expecting because we should be done with 130% LRs um, I think it could be a super 17 now the cool thing someone said this on, on, on my stream They're like well, why why not have it? You know Hellfighter and 17 
and then it's a transformation unit because how many um, uh, extreme transformation units that we have that have two different units on here I don't think any right is there anybody who transforms and you have two characters like a Goku and Vegeta transforms into Super Vegito uh, or Gogeta etc 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 this would be really cool to see a you know, Hellfire 17 and a 17 uh, be the standalone card initially and then he transforms into Super 17 I think that's cool so shout outs to uh, forget the person who actually mentioned that in my stream so I think that's a really great idea and I think that would be very very hype for 150% like GT boss category I guess you would make an androids or, or something something of that nature I, I really don't want to see another androids category uh, leader on here maybe target Goku or something yeah 150% the target Goku and 150% and the GT bosses I think that would be very very interesting here uh, if they continue to you know have another option for 150% LR upcoming, then you can have Baby Vegeta. Now, I don't want to see Super Baby, right? Because we kind of have that already as an LR, but Baby Vegeta, the SSR version of this, right? So uh, I can see that as well. This could be GT bosses. It could be, um, you know, maybe a, a new category, like, you know, kind of possessed category or something like that. Do we have something like that? Uh, I don't even uh, remember. Um, it could also be like uh, evil say I don't know I'm just throwing other things out there for another category but for sure GT bosses and I think this would work here right and uh, she, you know once again the legends artwork is really really good so the, the artwork came from Dragon Ball Legends but uh, uh, but yeah baby Vegeta would be cool to see I think that's an option to have versus a super baby since we already have a super baby super baby 2 that is so um, and then the final one I think the most likely if they're going to do a LR upcoming is an Omega Shenron, right? We have the Shenron or the uh, Shadow Dragon Army. This would make it a, a strong case that they're going to do an Omega Shenron LR GT boss. Um, so this would work, right? A GT boss category and, and then a Shadow Dragon Saga category, right? So that would make uh, sense 1000% at 150% across the board on both. Uh, or make a 170. Well, I don't think they'll make 170% uh, on these LRs unless this is going to be a special one and make it 170% on both GT GT bosses and uh, Shadow Jack is at 170%. That'd be great, but I don't know. Now I'm just wishful thinking at this point in time. Um, but uh, yeah, these are really the only three options for GT bosses. And if you had a choice, so this is the question for you guys, the viewers here. If you had a choice between a Super 17, that's a transformation Super 17, I think that's a really cool idea. Uh, so Hellfighter and regular 17, and then transforms into Super 17, or you can have a uh, Baby Vegeta, not a Super Baby, but a Baby Vegeta, or a Omega Shenron, which one would you choose to be the dual category 150% LRs? Uh, that could be coming out in part two of the Golden Week celebration. So let me know in the comment section below. And if you are, are new to my channel, like, subscribe, do all that good stuff. Anyway, I figured I'd just make this video here and uh, begin a discussion. So with that, uh, thank you all for watching. Keep on doconing. We'll catch you next time. Later.